Hello everyone, I'm Ian from Creative Visuals and I just have a really quick video for you today about the Mavic Pro 2. So about an hour ago DJI released a video about the Mavic Pro 2 obviously the See the Bigger Picture event has been rescheduled for August 23rd, 2018 and yeah we don't know too much about why that happened other than people thinking it was hype and I don't deny that but I'm going to go much more into detail about this later today so stay tuned for that video but I just wanted to go over this real quick with for you guys just because it just came out and I really just want to tell you guys my thoughts on it before I go way too in depth on it like in some other videos so if you like me going way into depth stay tuned for those and let's get right into this video so as you can see in the first few seconds this is like the very first second of this video, it hasn't even started yet, and we see a glimpse of what pretty much undoubtedly is the Mavic Pro 2's battery. So, uh, yeah, that's looking from the back to the front of the drone, I would say, if we just play it here. As you can see right there, kind of, that is like the, you can see the curves, you can see that looks like a Mavic Pro. Uh, new battery that lights up that looks pretty cool I don't see the battery indicators so maybe they move those somewhere else because on the old Mavic Pro batteries they had them right under the power button which didn't light up so maybe it just shows you by what color it is maybe I'm not sure what's going on there I would I guess they could show it maybe green 100 percent to 75 orange 75 to 50 yellow maybe 50 to 25 and then red would be 25 to somewhere around zero so something like that would be my guess but this is the only glimpse we get at the drone and it has a pretty similar appearance to the Mavic Pro like very similar and that doesn't really surprise me think about the Phantom series it hasn't changed much it's just got a bit sleeker and this one does look like it has a bit more of an aerodynamic design not so much as my Mavic Air but I, it's it's aerodynamic it looks like got some nice curves <laughs> so to continue on here it's a normal DJI video with some crazy footage that is absolutely insane like look at these people this, this stuff's just crazy and some kid running and some just normal stuff so as you can see there it went um, this is the first thing I noticed is that this shot right there it seems like the camera went backwards, so it's either they flipped the footage just to have a cool effect, or the camera can go much further down and like straight down and back. Um, I don't know if they'd add a feature like that. I know the Parrot Anafi goes like straight up, so maybe this one goes straight down and back. I don't know what's going on there, but it was kind of a cool effect. And when we keep going, we see some more normal crazy DJI footage. And then this shot is another one that kind of made me think. So as you can see, this is kind of an inside shot, something that you would probably see in videos being done by an Inspire series. So what this leads to me, me to believe is either they are flying a drone in here and interrupting this orchestra, or maybe there is a removable, removable gimbal, kind of like the GoPro Karma. It's been in a lot of the leaks for the DJI Mavic Pro 2. So maybe they are going to be adding a removable gimbal for these kind of inside shots that would be pretty cool uh hopefully it's not a fail like the gopro karma but uh dji always does good stuff i have to say they, they have a good track record so to continue on here right there right r that shot right there as you can see that was a dolly zoom and if you don't know what that is that's pretty much where you zoom in or out while f moving the camera. It's been used in a lot of movies and basically to do that you need to be able to zoom in the camera or do it in post-processing but I really do not believe that they would add this just for <laughs> no reason. Um, it, they usually have, there's usually meaning behind their videos like these um, and as you can see, that, that was an obvious dolly zoom, so I'm thinking maybe the leaks about the Mavic Pro 2, not the Mavic 2, having the zoom camera, I think that might be true. That's pretty. That's a pretty good indicator right there. 
And from here on, we see a lot of hyperlapses, which both of these things, both zooming and hyperlapses, you can already do on pretty much any drone for in post-processing with 4K footage, you can easily zoom in on it and create a dolly zoom effect. And for hyperlapses, you just need to use the path uh, feature in drones to make it do this. It's just kind of hard to figure out how long to make the drone fly for really slowly and how far you want to get before the battery dies. So it would be kind of interesting if they added this as an actual feature, but really any drone that DJI has out now could add this in a software update. So uh, yeah, some hyperlapses here. They are really cool. There's no doubt about that. And then we just go back to the, see the bigger picture. 10 a.m. New York on August 23rd, 2018. The same picture which I went over uh, with the like eye and it looks like some kind of 360 thing going on here. But all of this I'm going to go over today. I have some old videos on the Mavic Pro 2 that are actually like quite a few months old now and they're actually surprisingly accurate. So if you want to go check those out before I get my updated one out later today, feel free to. I'll leave them somewhere here. But yeah, so that's that's what I'm going to be going over today. I hope you guys enjoyed. Those are my like initial findings in this video before I go way too far into detail. 